Hey, what's up, everyone? Uh, David here, Tri County Customs. Figured, might as well bring you guys along the journey of some of the work I do. Good, getting ready to do up uh, an aluminum door. Let me bring that up for you. It's all prepped, wiped down, ready to be sprayed with some primer. Make it nice and smooth. Then it's going to go nice gloss white. So let's, let's get our gun out here. We've got the Nords and Encore all set. Let's start spraying some white or primer. Just bear with me. This is the first video I'm doing of hopefully what is going to be many. And hopefully with each one I end up getting a little bit better on my editing skills. Make the content a little bit better. Show you a lot better pieces. Sorry about the air compressor. trying to finish getting the shop set up a little bit nicer I uh, still recovering from where the shop had burnt down on me almost just over a year ago we got the door handles I actually have a couple a couple sets of these doors that's why there's so many handles nice light primer to, they're gonna spend their life in the salt water yeah right. with the magic of video editing we have everything all lined up hanging ready to go so let's get the door closed and get some heat going I just finished up getting the primer all set done it's all nice and uh, I got it to the point where it's flowed out so now we got to put the the white to it make this door look yeah you can kind of you can see it's already nice and smooth you kind of hard to see the reflection in there on the floor but You will definitely be able to see it once I'm done. So let's start spraying some white here. The light attachment on this Nordson gun makes things so much nicer to be able to see what's, how I sprayed, where I sprayed. And if, in case you're wondering, it's a Nordson Encore with a box feed system. So I've got a 50 pound box of this white from Tiger Dry Lac on there. 
and I can spray till it's empty which is great when I'm doing these large panels like these doors They're, they come in about six five and a half six feet tall a couple feet wide I know the, the video on this is probably not going to be the greatest. Like I said, this is my first video, first attempt. Hopefully from here forward, it's going to get bigger, better, and start showing a lot more of the custom work that I do at the same time. I've been powder coating for going on 15 years. Um, my oven, six feet tall, six feet wide, eight feet deep. Got it off Ted's Fabrication. Great guy to deal with. I'm not sure if he's still in business or if he still makes them this size, but. Uh, if you're looking for an oven, go check them out. These doors that I'm doing, they're for a local shop that I've been working with for about five or six years now. They get sold out to uh, boat builders, boat shops. And uh, before you know it, if you go fishing, you're probably going to have one of these doors on here too. There. There's my gun. I've got everything all, all set and dialed in. Get the heat going back in there and come back. Two hours later. Alright, oven just finished up on this door. I got one of the door handles to show you. Didn't look too much, still, still quite warm. You can see how smooth and high gloss that is. Once I've still got the door frames to do, once I get the door frames, I'm going to make a quick video of that as well. Uh, may not be as much as I did on this one. You can only have so many videos showing the same thing. Spraying primer, spraying white on bare aluminum. But I will also make sure to have a video at the end of it showing what the door itself looks like when it's done. So if you like this video, want to see more, see how far I make it, just hit the subscribe button and uh, we'll keep making more videos. Till next time.